Hello everybody, I've got some uh, Angel card readings today from my favourite deck Angel Power Wisdom Cards by Gay Guffrey We're going to have six cards from this deck and some messages from this deck and that is the Archangel Michael Sword of Light Oracle Radley Valentine Not long to Christmas Anyhow Merry Christmas to everybody all my fans out there Merry Christmas Do you like me at my Christmas hat? Right I might even uh, have a couple of jokes with it being Christmas from this joke book a couple of jokes after the card reading Right let's get on with the card reading Card 1 Can you take this card, number one, my fans out there today? And it is Archangel Michael. Michael prov provides protection and strength for you. So if you need protection and strength out there, Michael it is the one. Archangel Michael. If you've got any negative or bad energy around you, call on Archangel Michael. He'll clear it for you. We don't want bad energy near Christmas, do we? Right, uh, number two card. Oh, isn't that lovely? Can you see that, eh? Look at that. Eyes, look at the eyes on that. And this is Eyes of Love. Focus your eyes on loving actions and your lips on loving words so to focus our eyes and our action and our words all to do with love eh? can you take number three card and that is the power of angels may your angels protect you guide you and keep you safe a lot of protections in these cards in this reading can you take number four card my fans out there today and that is intentions intentions is the creative power that fulfills our dreams as your will so is your destiny card number five Oh, I wish I could have that angel book. Have you seen how massive it is? It's massive, that angel book there. Mind you, my partner wouldn't uh, like it. She's already complaining about all angel cards I've got and decks taking up half a room. So she wouldn't, she wouldn't like me buying that a massive angel book like that, would she? But it's lovely, lovely, giant book there. Now let's get on time's time eh? Angel of Wisdom Angel of Wisdom Knowledge is spiritual growth and I keep having this card this is our final card see that angel coming down steps what she's saying to us all, even me, and all my fans out there, and anyone who's watching this video, heaven's message, message coming down from heaven to give us this message. And the message is, your loved ones in heaven want you to know, all our loved ones in heaven wanting us to know, that they are safe, protected, reunited with family and friends. So they're all reunited in heaven with family and friends. So she come down to give us this message. Isn't that nice for Christmas, eh? Think of other loved ones at Christmas. Sit back and just remember them, you know, all the good times you had with them. So that's a good card, isn't it? Our last, our last one of from uh, my favourite Dick. 
Right, let's get on to messages cards from this deck. The six cards. Can you take number one today? And that is welcome abundance into your life. Well, we all need abundance, don't we? Right at this moment, we've all problems we're having with money, aren't we? All of us, every one of us. Prosperity is it's on its way. Well, I hope so. Have faith that the source will ear your financial problems. We're going to heal our financial problems. Well, the quicker the better, I say. Right. Number two card. And that is, all is in perfect timing. Well, not too sure perfect timing at the moment, is there? We're not coming our way at the moment with strikes and that and money and, oh, we're in a right mess, aren't we, coming up to Christmas. This is the time to take action now. Well, they are taking action. They're taking strikes, aren't they? This suits them. I will be here to help you in every step of the way. So the angels are going to help you striking. I don't know about the MPs. So that the card says your angels are going to help you with the, all you're going on strike. <laughs> number three card today. Can you take number three? And that is recognise the signs from above. We have to recognise all the signs from our guardian angels, our spirit guides, our loved ones what's passed away. We have to make sure we keep our eyes open and our ears open and look for signs from them. Eh? All trying to send us signs. And this is angels are sending you messages now. But you're too distracted to notice. Stay alert and open to the divine guidance. Number four card. And that is you will manifest what you need. Express gratitude as your plans have already come to pass. Oh, right. Trust that your angels are bringing you assistance you need. Well, I hope so. I really hope so. Our fifth card. Increase your knowledge. Oh, we've all increased as knowledge next year, all of us and my fans out there. Education brings opportunities. Take a course, pick up a book. I'll be picking up a few books next year because I'm going to go to the library and read some children's books to my adult fans. Would you believe it? Adult fans wanting children's books. Take a book, uh, find a, a mentor, a teacher. You want, you want your soul to know. Right. Don't know whether I read that a little bit last week, a bit wrong, but we won't worry about it at this moment in time, will we? Our final card. What we got here? Trust your guidance you're receiving. Right, we've got to trust our guidance from us, angels and spirits. We've got to trust them. Archangel Uriel, I blessed you with a brilliant empathy. I am also present to clear away worries so you can trust your divine soul. Call on Yorio to get rid of all our worries we have. Right, let's see if we can have a couple of jokes eh? We it being Christmas. I might tell a few more jokes coming up to Christmas on my card, re on my card readings. Just bear with me because I'm trying to look through the book. Uh, let's see if we've got one. Let's have a look. I got a new pair of gloves today, but they're both lefts, lefts. On one hand it's great, but on the other it's just not right. <laughs> yeah, these jokes there. Eh? You've got to laugh, aren't you? You've got to laugh. Right, we'll have another one. Eh? My left knee has never committed a crime <laughs> my left knee's never committed a crime <laughs> i can't stay i can't say the same for his felony felony <laughs> you get it felony i was recently burgled they took my life jacket life jacket you know and my portable oxygen tank it was my entire life savings. <laughs> yeah, I get that. I, I sort of get that, yeah. 
I get that. I hope you're keeling over laughing out there. It's Christmas, isn't it? It's coming up to Christmas. People overcome adversity all the time. I mean, just look at Beethoven. They told him he was deaf, but he listened. I think I've had that one before uh, this week. Yeah, I think I've had the Beethoven one this week. Let's see if we've got some more for you before I get off. A giant fly is attacking the local police force. They have called for assistance from the SWAT team. Oh, yeah, I get that. I get that one. I'm keeling over here. I really am. After I was arrested, my ex-wife decided to hang up a picture of my mugshot on the wall of her living room. Look at my mugshot. But she, but she still won't admit she framed me. I've got to read this one again. I think this is, we'll finish on this one. This is my favourite. I like favourite one of the joke from this joke book. It's lovely. After I was arrested, my ex-wife decided to hang up a picture of my mugshot on the wall in her living room. But she still won't admit she framed me. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Catch you on the next video.